Shape and Fish Posh Baby, and today we are going to be talking about the top double strollers currently on the market. We definitely have a lot to cover. We're talking about six different strollers, and we are listing them from lowest to highest price point. So without further ado, let's get on to the rest of this video. All right, so the first one on our list is the Britect Be Lively Double. It retails for $429.99. It weighs 29 pounds and has a weight capacity of 100 pounds. And it is a newborn car seat compatible, but it can only hold one car seat. Now, as far as maneuverability goes, it does have some really, really nice suspension. It has all-wheel suspension, and the wheels are a nice size. They're 6.5 inches in the front, 9.5 inches in the back. The handlebar also is nice and sturdy, and you can adjust the angle of it quite easily to fit your height. As far as comfortability goes, this is definitely a very comfortable stroller. They're individual canopies and definitely have a really nice peekaboo window that's ventilated. Really great for those hot summer months. Now, as far as the seats go, you're going to get that five-point harness and you're going to get a really nice footrest as well that you can actually sit out. And it gives you access to the storage. The storage on this stroller is really, really nice. Now, the only downside to the underseat storage to basket is that there is no cover. And what I mean by that is there's nothing protecting your stuff from spilling out. If you look over here, it's nice, it's big. You can definitely fit a large diaper bag in, but you do have to be conscious of your stuff coming out. And there are pockets on the back of each seat that you can zip out as well as smaller pockets on the outside as well. So you definitely get a lot of room when it comes to the Protect Be Lively and folding it is really easy. Unfortunately, we have a prototype right here. So we have the store model where people use them all the time and this one doesn't fold as nicely. So I'm just going to put a photo in on how, uh, how it looks folded. It's definitely a very small fold and it is an easy fold if it's not the prototype. And that is it for the Protect Be Lively. All right, so up next we have the Baby Jogger City Mini GT2. The Baby Jogger City Mini GT2 retails for $599.99. It weighs 36.5 pounds and has a weight capacity of 50 pounds. It has pretty good steering. The handlebar is adjustable, so it's really easy to just steer this stroller. And it has eight and a half forever air wheels with all wheel suspension, so you are going to get a very, very nice smooth ride for your child. And as far as comfortability goes, it's definitely very comfortable. The canopies are large and spacious. They're individual with a magnetic peekaboo window. The seats are heavily padded with a five-point harness, as well as individually reclinable, so you can have one child sleeping while the other one is awake. The footrests are also adjustable. But something that I really love about the adjustable footrest is it gives you better underseat storage access because it is open so you can actually pull out some things from the front and the back if you store it in the underseat storage basket. And I'm just going to lift this back up so you can get a better shot of the storage. Definitely can fit at least two large diaper bags in there and then some. And finally, I do want to talk to you about the fold really quickly. To fold it, it actually folds very, very similarly to the Vertex B Lab Big Double. Um, so if you want to see how that one folds, it's very, very similar. I'm just gonna break it really quick, and it has a really nice nifty hand break. And I'm gonna go over to the front, and there are little levers or little hooks that say pull to fold. So I'm gonna follow the directions, and it folds right here, super easy. And then to open it back up, I'm, all I'm going to do is go to this side, unlock it, and pull up. And now I'm going to unbreak it as well. And here you go. That is the fold and unfold. And this is the Baby Jogger City Mini GT2. So number three in our list is the Vaco Baby Snap Duo Trend. The Vaco Baby Snap Duo Trend retails for $699.95. It weighs 24 pounds and has a weight capacity of 90 pounds. As far as maneuverability goes, it is pretty easy to maneuver. The handlebar is slightly adjustable. As far as the other ones go, this one probably has the most limited adjustable handlebar. You could just change the angle slightly, nothing too crazy. 
but they have 8 inch by 10 inch wheels, so the wheels are 8 inches in the front, 10 inches in the back. They're puncture proof EVA wheels, so you do get a pretty smooth ride. Your child is also going to be extremely comfortable when it comes to the back of Baby Snap Doe Trend. It does a really great job of protecting your little one from those harmful sun rays. There's actually two zip out compartments in the canopy that extend the canopy further down. They also have individual magnetic peekaboo windows that are ventilated for some really great airflow. The seats are pretty standard, although they do have a pretty nice head height. But they're a five point harness, belly bar, adjustable footrest. And of course, it is reclinable. It's a one hand recline. I already have it reclined for you. But it's super easy to recline. The storage is also top notch. You do get a little pocket on the back of the seat where you can fit your keys or your phone, little knickknacks like that. And the underseat storage basket can definitely fit at least two large diaper bags in there and then some. So you definitely get a lot, a lot of storage when it comes to this stroller. And then finally, folding this stroller is beyond easy. It probably has the easiest fold out of all of the strollers we're going to talk about today. So the first thing I'm going to do is lock the stroller. So I'm just going to break it. And the brakes are actually picture coated, so I'm just going to put it in the lock position. And there are function buttons on the bottom, on the top of the middle of the stroller, or the handlebar. So I'm just going to press down, and it just locks into place just like that. Super easy, and it folds down pretty flat. Now to open it is also really easy as well. I just unlock it, and it is good to go. You can fit up to two car seats in this stroller and it is also newborn compatible with the use of a bassinet as well. So you definitely get a lot of options when it comes to the Mapo Baby. All right, so up next we have the Mal Buggy Duet which retails for $699.99. It weighs 32 pounds and has a weight capacity of 79 pounds. It is newborn and car seat compatible and can hold up to two different car seats. As far as maneuverability goes, it has really, really nice brakes. It not only has a foot brake, it has a little hand brake so you can stop in a dime. The wheels are 10 inch air filled wheels so you do have to keep in mind that they are air filled. But they also have front swivel locking wheels so it does really, really good on all different terrains. As far as the handlebar goes and the steering, the steering is pretty straightforward. It's an adjustable angle, so you can change the angle and the height to accommodate taller or shorter parents. As far as comfortability goes, the canopies are large and spacious, so it'll make sure that your child is cool during those hot summer months. It has a little ventilated pop-out visor and individual peekaboo windows that have a little plastic covering so you can peek at your little one as they're sleeping. Now, the seats are super comfortable. They're heavily padded five-point harnesses. They have a minor little adjustable footrest. It's not extremely adjustable, but you can lift it up. And the footwell is pretty deep, so it can accommodate taller children. The storage on this stroller is large and spacious. You definitely can fit a lot in the underseat storage basket. And then there is also this little Joey bag, this little bag. Then you can bring other stuff, you just attach it to the handlebar. But one thing that I do love when it comes to storage is that the Malbo You Duet is very similar to the Bugaboo Donkey 3, which we'll be talking about later on in this video. You can go from duo to mono mode. It can be a double or it can just be a single stroller, and I like having that option. Um, but back to breaking the stroller, I'm just going to permanent break it. So I'm just going to use a foot brake and put that lever down. And I'm going to make sure the wheels are facing this way. And bring the handlebar all the way down just so it's out of the way. And then finally, there is a little function button underneath the wheels that I'm just going to press down. And there is the mountain buggy duet folded. And to unfold it, it's pretty easy as well. I'm just going to and just lift it up just like that. And I'm going to put the handlebar back up, make sure it's locked into place. 
and then unlock the strollers, and there is the mound buggy duet fold and unfold. On to the next one. All right, so up next we have the Bumble Ride Indie Twin. The Bumble Ride Indie Twin retails for $7.99. It weighs 36 pounds, so it does have some weight to it and has a weight capacity of 90 pounds. As far as maneuverability goes, it has pretty good suspension. It also has air filled tires. Now the handlebar is adjustable. It's an angle adjust, so you can just change the angle slightly. And as far as comfortability goes, it's super comfortable. It is newborn and car seat compatible. It can hold up to two car seats. The canopies are large and spacious. They have 45 plus protection. They have individual ventilated peekaboo windows. So you know your child is safe and comfortable with these canopies. As far as the seats go, they each have an individual belly bar, five point harnesses, individual adjustable footrests that you can adjust to your child's comfort, and the seats do recline. You can recline them using one hand. And as far as storage goes, they do each have a lot of storage. Now, the underseat storage basket is a little bit on the smaller side. You can definitely fit a large diaper bag in there, maybe squeeze two. But there is also storage on the back of the seats. You can fit your keys, your phone, anything like that in there. And they each, each seat has a little pocket. And as far as fold, fold is pretty easy as well. I'm just going to break the stroller first. And I'm just going to press down on the brake. And then there are function buttons below the handlebar that I just press. And it just folds right down. And I'm just going to make sure it locks. And now that I know that it's locked, this is how it folds. Does fold down pretty small. Definitely not the smallest, but pretty nice. And then to open it back up, all I'm going to do is unlock it from its side. and lift back up. Nothing too crazy, nothing too hard. And that is it for the Bubble Ride Indie Twin. All right, so last but certainly not least, we have the Bugaboo Donkey 3, which retails for $12.99 plus. It does go up depending on different colors and customization options. As far as the weight goes, it weighs 27 pounds and has a weight capacity of 50 pounds. It is newborn and car seat compatible with the use of adapters, which are sold separately, but it can hold up to two car seats and two bassinets, so definitely a lot of different options you can choose from when it comes to actually putting together the Bugaboo Donkey 3. Now, as far as maneuverability goes, it has a really, really nice push. The wheels are 10 inches in the front, 12 inches in the back. They are EVA wheels, so you don't have to worry about pumping them up or anything like that. And it has all-wheel suspension, so it is a very, very smooth ride. And steering it is really easy because it has an adjustable handlebar that goes up pretty far. So it can really, really accommodate out of all these strollers to really accommodate a taller to shorter parent. As far as comfortability, your child is definitely going to be comfortable. The canopy blocks out the sun. It is large and spacious and zips out even further down. Does a really great job at blocking those harmful sun rays. Has a nice little ventilated peekaboo window. This toddler seat is definitely comfortable. You can just adjust the harness. It's a non-rethread harness. So you don't have to worry about hard, like rethreading it. Five-point harness. A nice updated belly bar that actually swivels out now. The footrest is deep and nice. And it has a one-handed recline. Now, it's also the only stroller on this list that has a reversible seat. Now, I'm going to actually keep the seat down just so you can get a better view of the underseat storage basket. So, the underseat storage basket is definitely really, really big. There is a compartment in there that you can actually slide some things in, but it is a very large underseat storage basket. There is also a storage pocket on the bassinet that you can just slide things in as well. Now that I have the stroller in this position though, I want to show you how to fold it really quick. The easiest way that I find to fold it is to break the stroller and it's just a normal little foot break and to actually take both the seats out. So I'm just going to do that. And I like to put it in mono mode when I fold it just because it's a little bit easier. 
And this one is super easy to turn into mono mode. I, I just unclick the tabs, squeeze it together, and lock everything in place. And then finally to fold it, it folds exactly like the fox. So I'm just going to squeeze the things together. And there you go. Here's the Bugaboo Donkey 3 all folded up. And to unfold it, I am just going to press the same function buttons. And I'm going to unbreak it, and there is the Bugaboo Donkey 3 folded and unfolded, and I'm just put everything back like normal, and there it is. All right, thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you guys have any questions or comments about any of these drillers, please let me know in the comments section down below. I'll answer them as soon as possible. If you want some more information about any of these strollers, they all have their individual videos that should be linked in the description section. So make sure to check that out as well. And like always, please like, subscribe, and have an amazing day.